The wheel of a school bus. He says he saw danger and spoke up. Parents applaud him, but his school bus company fired him. CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff with the exclusive story tonight of a driver fired because he took a safety concern to the wrong person. The kids can get hit by a car or a truck. School bus driver Willie Tui says he couldn't stand by watching what he calls an accident waiting to happen. I'm seeing kids walking the path of trucks that are coming into the loop. While buses line up at Saxton Middle School, children, he says, dart around delivery and maintenance trucks allowed into the bus loop. He spoke up last year but claims nothing changed, so again he complained to the district superintendent. He then got fired. He's got to shut that camera off. His employer, Montauk Bus Service, refused to comment but issued this termination letter citing serious misconduct to a disregarded policy that all drivers are to report any and all concerns to their immediate supervisor, not school district personnel. He didn't follow chain of command protocol. Don't fire me because I'm speaking out about a safety issue. You know what I mean? So all I'm looking for is, you know, vindication. You know what I mean? Why would you fire somebody who cares about the safety of the kids? The kids love him. Parents are trying to get the beloved driver's job back. I'm heartbroken because, you know, he didn't deserve it. Tui contacted attorney Kenneth Mullins, who says workers who report law-breaking bosses are protected, but not in this case. Here we don't have an employee versus an employer. Here we have an employee speaking out uh, to protect the students on his bus. That takes him out of the scope of the whistleblower statute. Still, parents don't understand why it matters who was told when safety's at issue. This school bus loop unique. Buses share an entrance with trucks. Um, the maintenance vehicles do go in that way. The superintendent of the Patchogue Medford School District tells me they address all safety concerns immediately, and he personally has not seen this to be a problem. But Tui says from behind the wheel of a school bus, he has. In Patchogue, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. And the school district would not comment on Tui's termination of employment because they are not the ones that fired him. Tui says he took his concerns directly to the school district because they offered an open door policy on safety matters. We have